my name is Josh Wilson, and you can find me online at newsdesk.org. And you have a pitch on Spot Us, correct? Uh, the focus is going to be on uh, explanatory coverage of uh, confusing, misleading, deceptive, and otherwise not above the uh, table uh, election advertising. Mostly those uh, circulars but also that are mailed to you by the bucket, but also TV ads, to try to determine the factuality behind the assertions that are made, to cut through all the uh, um, innuendo and swift boating that's going to be going on, and uh, reveal also the funders of these advertisements and what their interests are, and really just kind of strip away the, the gauze and, and reveal to the, uh, uh, the everyday voter exactly the, what is being asserted, whether it's true, and uh, who's paying the bills so they can make more informed decisions at the polls. So how long have you had this idea for, for an investigation? Uh, this one came to me, um, well, I mean, every time there's an election, you just, you know, I would say probably the last three or four years, um, you know, because you just, I remember there was one for a, uh, opposed to a San Francisco DA candidate, uh, Kamala Harris, who eventually did get elected, and they just sent us this really expensive, uh, fancy mailer, um, you know, glossy, you know, four-color kind of thing, um, with cockroaches on the cover. And it just didn't occur to me that that was a really a, a meaningful uh, contribution to electoral discourse, you know. And wouldn't it be nice if there was a way we could find out who was paying for it and what the real issues are? Uh, so it's been on my mind for a while. And after Grade the News lost its funding, that's that whole element of media criticism and, and uh, media reporting is pretty much gone from the Bay Area. So we see a great opportunity. Okay. Well, thank you very much. We'll look for the pitch on uh, Spot.us. Thank you, David.